Korea Info, we are back on your radio. I'm Sharif Quadri. I'm Jimmy Disu. Good morning. Mm. I'm sure I can hear you well. Okay. I am Jimmy Disu. Good morning, everybody. Mm. Good morning, that's, sir. That's better. Yeah, it's better. Right. It's better. You can watch us online, Facebook, and on YouTube. Just type in Nigeria Info 99.3. Let's go through the papers this morning together. We're going to start with the Vanguard newspaper, page 9. I didn't speak with Tinubu judges handling OB articles petitions, CJN. <laughs> okay, maybe he should say that he didn't speak with him on the subject concerned. Mm. Uh, because like one of your callers said this morning... Um, it's not odd for the president to speak to the CJ. Indeed, they, would, they could even have meetings, um, uh, you know. Um, so, uh, well, given what you said this morning about AI, a, 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 a yes, a a a uh, which is very, very valid, um, one needs to be very careful and circumspect about things like this. Um, besides, the way these things operate, from what I hear and what I know, if you have a case with a judge, whether you are the plaintiff or the or the accused, you don't need to you don't need to go speak to the judge. That is those who are inclined to be corrupt. Uh, there are enough there are enough touts, quote and unquote touts, including yeah. some retired judges and some lawyers who whose main forte and some of them boast about it is to arrange judgments. So. Even if, even if the president did want to influence judgment, he doesn't need to talk to the CJ himself. There, there are enough executive touts, um, um, you know, to do that, which is very, very sad. It's very, very sad. Um, we hear a lot of things, of course, some of them not really validated. But yes, you do hear situations where lawyers, you know, part of the fees, are, when you hear sometimes that the fee is X amount, be rest assured that that amount also includes what you call a brokerage fee. Mm. Um, you know, so I, I think we should disregard this. Uh, the president definitely is very, very unlikely that he'd be talking to the he has enough executive top level types in the profession who, who, who can do that. Uh, and I'm sure some of the lawyers understand what I'm talking mm. about. Uh, so I, I, I just say that look, disregard these things and be very careful. This, um, a, what did you call it again? A AI. A AI. Mm. This AI thingy um, is going to get a lot of us into trouble. For example, at about 2 a.m. this morning, some news came up on Twitter that some judge had retired, you know, retired, and they gave the reasons. And it, it didn't add up. Oh, the judge said that it appeared he was being influenced by the federal government on the case. And, and I said, ah, even if a judge were to retire or to resign for, for that reason, it is not going to be that explicit. Lo and behold, this morning, I haven't seen anything in the papers. Have you seen anything like that? Nothing at all. Nothing at all. Mm. So let's let's. Be, it's, this has now made our job extremely difficult. And I would please understand we, we are only humans. Sometimes we fall victim to these things. In our own case here, I can assure you that once it is not on paper, mm. because. These people can even clone sites of the newspapers. Mm -hmm. You get what I'm mm -hmm. saying? They can clone the sites. They can. So it's not everything that you say. They can. Um, they can clone your Twitter handle. They can. Look, I'm so scared now. I I don't know which way to turn because they can actually land you in a whole lot of trouble. Mm -hmm. Just like you described it today. Yeah. Do you know that with AI now they can put Sheriff's head on my own mm -hmm. and Sheriff's own so Sheriff will be the one wearing the t shirt mm -hmm. and <laughs> wearing his bubba and chocolate and things like that. Nothing that can be done. Mm -hmm. And this is going to ruin the world ultimately. Uh, I, I, that much I can say. A lot of people are going to it will get embarrassed. Mm -hmm. I, I remember one they did for Oshiomele. It wasn't even AI then, but where they, ha you know, they have to put his head somewhat in a <laughs> in a porno scene, and that was was terrible. <laughs> uh, he had he had his own bit of that. So let's all be very careful. I don't think this happened. And for those who know, they will tell you that. But like a caller also said um, something to the effect that okay, the 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 the, the CJ 
uh, you know, has been fraternizing with certain politicians and so on and so forth. Yes, openly. I think that was in Port Harcourt and so on and so forth. But I, I, I think that the CJ is not on trial here, uh, though part of uh, what his actions are what we are going to discuss at nine. Apparently, it appears as if uh, there's a new set of judges coming up, and one incidentally happens to be his son. Mm. And so we have to look at the rights of that. There's anything on what has happened lawyer in to that side. But also, don't go to the government. Let's always, let's always. And those who are missing are not in there. That's right. Let's just calm down. Okay, just calm down. All of us just need to calm down. In fact, we have, we have bigger fish to fry. We're talking about now. I don't think I'm this. As long as this present problem can be solved. Food in this small mud that's making me make 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 me uh, let's, uh, well, sometimes we have to have a bit of fun. There's enough to give you a headache. Hey. Um, mm. Since I made the rule to listen to Sheriff at 5 <laughs> o'clock in the morning, I've regretted it. <laughs> 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 I've regretted it. Um, you would hear people close to tears. Mm. Close to tears. You would hear people who couldn't be bothered about the plight of other people because they are comfortable. All kinds of you mustn't miss sheriff at, at that early morning uh, to listen to people. You have people who are very one man took him to the cleaners today and <laughs> tore him to pieces. So there's enough of that. There's enough of that to go around. So we'll try and lighten the burden a little bit. Yes. Uh, now that at least there's daylight. Yeah, we'll mm. try. We'll, we'll try. try. Let's flip through to page ten. The Vanguard. No apologies for sending my kids to private school, Governor Fubar. I mean, how does one say this? Okay, Governor Governor Fubara is 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 um, Governor Simina Lai Fubara is the governor is newly appointed governor of River State. Newly elected governor. Newly elected. Ah, sorry, Daddy. Newly elected. So he took time off his heavy schedule to attend his uh, his daughter's um, private school. What do they call this? End of year, whatever it is. Yeah. Uh, with all the things that he has to do, he was able to squeeze in time because, according to him. Oh, when his daughter wakes up every morning, she keeps asking if he's going to come. Fair enough. You can't fault him on that. Uh, but to now say that um, uh, uh, that that uh, uh, he has no apologies for sending his kids to private school at a time like this is highly insensitive. He didn't say this when he was campaigning. Hmm. He didn't say this when he was campaigning. So you can see the arrogance in some of our, our leaders, the contempt they have. For, for, for the people that they superintend over, that kind of comfort. How, why would you say, I have no apologies? It, 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 it's, it's, it, I have to be very careful. I'll enter live one of these days. <laughs> <laughs> it, it, it's not, it, 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 it's, it's this kind of comment is symptoms of something I can't describe on radio. You know, but it's something, if, if, I, if this was ever attributed to me, I probably would take a double dose of a sleeping pill. As what you call a Moluabi, you don't talk like this. I have no apologies. Come on. Come on. You don't need to ask. Let's assume that I was him and somebody asked me, Why is your child in a public school and uh, not in well, You uh, say, in, in private and not in public. Uh, private and not in public. Mm. I've said, Well, it, it, it's to be honest with you, you see, people must learn to talk yeah. things around. Yeah. I just tell the reporter yeah. you, uh, that, to be honest with you, I think you're right. I never thought of it that way. But know that I alone don't own this child. Mm, the mother is there. Mm, uh, uh, what are you mm, saying? Mm, mm. There is something called wisdom. Uh -uh. Say, this child is not mine alone. You know, I don't have that authority in my house. And the mother is not the governor, you know, but I, I appreciate it. And I hope people will understand. I will look into it if you try to do something about it. I can't give you some understanding. But to say that I have no apologies, we don't need that. And I wonder why this is coming from River State again. Are we having another wiki? So that's a very interesting question, actually, because only yesterday or so, yes. um, there was someone who sent me, I think two days ago, who sent me pictures of how this new governor, yes. you know, have his pictures splattered around buses that he put out. Okay. And these buses were supposed to be buses procured by, I think, Amechi. Okay. Okay. Yeah, so so like it's an interesting question. I'm wondering like maybe it's just something 
um, genetically ingrained in our politicians to want to just be the overlord. The regret I had this morning is that Professor Tolani Asumi has passed away. Professor Tolani Asumi has passed away. He used to be Nigeria's number one psychiatrist. Hmm. And I'd, I'd have loved to ask him. But I know there are still some top doctors there, but Professor Asuni is somebody who I know. In fact, I did an interview with him in my book. I would have asked him to explain to me what these symptoms indicate. And if there, if there will be a need to put in a new alternator or whatever it is to couple the engine again. and But it's all a mess. But you see, the truth is, for you out there, a lot of our elites, this is how they think. They are not sensitive to your plight. Forget it. I was thinking this morning, we keep talking about palliatives, palliatives, palliatives. Hmm. I'm sorry to divert to that, whatever. What about those who put us in this position? Are they going to get away with it? Nobody has said anything. There is no probe, no audit of, of, of the, the, the subsidy that has been given. No, no probe, nothing. Nobody has been arrested. Nobody has been accosted. And something tells me that if you look at the books, hmm. you will definitely be able to say, yes, there's an, there's, you know, there's an infringement here. There's something has happened here. No. It's just about, this is the way most of our elites go to YouTube, go to um, uh, 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 Instagram and so on and so forth. This is the way, this is the way they feel about you. Hmm. I, I, was I was trained to be sensitive, very sensitive, it, to my environment. I remember when I turned 65 and there was going to be some big bash at long before, and it, it was close to COVID, I just looked at the environment and said, I can't be having a big bash at a time like this. Hmm. And I called it off. It is there. It, you can, but a lot of our, our elite, they couldn't be bothered. In fact, they are happy. Hmm. The people of this country need to stand up very, very well if they want to be well taken care of. In all honesty, they, they need to stand up very, very well. But it's up to you. It's up to you. There, there's, I, I, there's, there's something I also would like to prescribe. Mm. Uh, I'm not a psychiatrist, but I, I, I would like to prescribe to our politicians and office holders to learn to take a break from work. It's not ingrained in them. Like, just take a vacation. It helps you reset. It helps you because all of these things that you just uh, blot out sometimes with proper rest, proper care, you would just, know how to manage some situations. This one just started now. Like, like you would... <laughs> it's all of it just started. <laughs> the truth is this. The truth is this. And I'm sorry to say this, but it has to be said. There's a character deficiency in most of our politicians. There's a, an if only mama could see me now, it's my turn. I, I've paid so much for this, hmm. therefore nobody can say anything. They've bought your vote. Okay, you are ready to line up every day. When they are coming to your community, you close down the school. They bought your vote. Nobody in that position can think straight unless God blesses him to realize that humility is key. Hmm. Look at, go to Instagram now. Look at, look at your elites. Look at, look at what they do. Hmm. I mean, you sit down, you sit down at the party. You are donning what I remember. Somebody was interviewed. The lady was saying her shoe is one million. Her this is that. Her this is that and that. Then you now get somebody who is earning thirty five thousand to come and guard you, somebody who who was who is earning ten thousand to come and serve you food, and you don't think that there's something wrong with that. It's ingrained in us, but we will be taught a bitter lesson very soon, individually and collectively. We will be taught. It's funny. I was joking with Sheriff yesterday. No, no one's Sheriff with the doctor in the house here, mm. and I was joking to him that say when people see me walking slowly now. They think that maybe it's age that has slowed me down. No, it's because I fell. The same thing is going to happen to Nigerians. Mm. When, we, when we push people to the wall and individually and collectively, they quote and unquote begin to deal with us, then we will learn our lessons. That mm. you can't take people for granted and you can't treat them in short, such a shoddy manner because uh, you have some certain advantage. It's ingrained in them. Most of them are, like I said, if only mama could see me now. Go check their background. You know, this mm. arrogance and that everybody is meaningless. Some are so bad that even if you greet them, they won't answer. Mm. 
Let's go next story. Let's go next story. This story reads anthrax outbreak. Stop eating pomo. Others, Ekiti government wants residents. Page eight. There is okay. no analysis in this story. Okay, don't expect anything. We just just want to use it to highlight the fact that once again we're warning people. I think for now, the safest thing is to avoid meat until this anthrax thing, this anthrax thing goes. And I'm sorry if, if you, Pomo, that you, you you know, and we've been warned about Pomo repeatedly. Pomo and Fuku. Mm. Okay. Why did you mention Fuku? Uh, Fuku too. Yes, we were told. I love Fuku. Oh my God. I'm uh, a Fuku. I'm in love. No, uh, no, you can't. Uh, we've been warned though. Don't eat Fuku. Yes, fuku. Yes, don't eat Fuku. Eat fuku, a dog. Fuku, Fuku, Fuku. Don't. <laughs> <laughs> Eat liver or other things. Don't. To be, to be. I mean, to be honest with you, the way the world is now, I think this is a very good time to be a vegetarian. Yeah. I opened a tin of uh, I love corned beef. I opened a tin of corned beef the other day, and was going to make myself a corned beef sandwich. Then I remember the video that I saw. Mm. We don't know whether it's AI, but they were putting <laughs> dead whatever things and rolling them out in the machine, oh, and so somewhere in China, you know. Um, in fact, some it looks as if some was part of human parts and so on and so forth. So I threw. This is coming. <laughs> <laughs> as soon as I away. no, because as soon as I put it, I said Jimmy Shaw. Do you remember what? <laughs> what you threw it away? I threw it away. Anybody who wants, I have some corned beef in the house. If you want, I'm ready to. I, I know that that's not what it is. I've been eating this all my life, but yeah. I just you know the, the way the human mind goes. I just couldn't. Um, so I think it's, uh, we should just be a vegetarian, not just fuku kanko, please. Mm -hmm. No fuku for you. I'll, I'll think about it. <laughs> I would think about it. Okay. All right. mm -hmm. Let's take this idea. They show us a role. This is a role. We need to stop giving roles. We need find a way that we can hold them responsible without adding traditional rulers to the list. Our local governments don't function well. Hmm. As state governors, you can see, they've gone south completely. Even even at presidential level, it is a bit of a sorry story, story to tell. I don't think we want the headache of adding traditional rulers. To. Let is exactly what the, the role that they have been given in any case, they haven't perfected it. Some of them have even deviated from that role. And I am sorry to say, I am sorry to say, some of them have not even shown res enough responsibility to be given that role. Share what we say is that in theory, all other elected officials will have the power to remove them. Mm. We haven't done so, but very soon we will get there. But a traditional ruler, if if he goes south, what do you do? Mm. So I don't I don't agree with the vanguard in in this. The what what they have been given in the first instance, let them carry it out uh, uh, effectively. Most of our most of our traditional rulers are far from the people. They keep saying, "Oh, we are nearest to the people." How can you be nearest to the people with two, three Rolls Royces and, and people can hardly even walk? A friend of mine went to m greet his mother in the village. I think mm. I've said this before. It was all these bungalows, six rooms to the right and six rooms to the left. He got there in the evening and found his mom in, in darkness. Mm. Ah, mama, he put on the la lantern now or whatever it is. Well, of course, there's no light in that part. He said, the woman said, no, it's not my turn today to use the lantern. Mm. Apparently... They rotate the lan lantern room by room. Oh. You need to know the level of poverty. So, if you, if you, if you, if you, and our traditional rulers can be ruthless. We also saw what happened during the Lagos, Lagos elections. What, what do we want to do? So, let's, let's, let's just keep them where they are. Uh, in other countries, they are trying to, even they, the traditional rulers themselves, are trying to take a back seat. Hmm. The world is very, very conscious about democracy. So it's difficult for you, you to give a role to somebody who has not been elected, uh, you know, to take a leading role. So I, I disagree with the vanguard. It's a well-reasoned editorial, however, but I, 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 dis, I disagree with them um, on, on this one. Mm -hmm. They say that let us put them to use making sure we put in checks and balances. Checks and balances have never worked in Nigeria. That's why subsidy is gone. Mm -hmm. Had we had checks and balances, there's nothing wrong with having the subsidy. In fact, we need to know what percentage of the amount spent on subsidies are due to fraud. Is it 40%? Is it 60%? And will we be shocked to hear that 80% of subsidy, whatever we pay, is as a result of fraud? We don't know. 
and we don't care. These people have put us in, in, into poverty now. We are supposed to tighten our belts and whatever it is, and they are going to go scot-free. I, I think let us just leave these traditional rulers where they are. Mm. Let's go to the punch on page uh, seven of the punch. Mesoma appears before reps panel, oh, no. begs jam. The shame of a country. The shame of a country. Just because some students, you know, you know, created some controversy in a national assembly. By the time this girl confessed last week, the national assembly to have to have told her, let them go and sort it out with jam. Such it. It's not trivial, yes, but it's it. They should be more concerned about our welfare. All this is grandstanding. This is grandstanding. As soon as she had confessed, and let the law take its place, for God's sake. This girl is 19. Am I right? Yes, she it, is. It means she's an adult. Mm. She should have been picked up by the police and properly investigated to see if, if, it was, if she's part of a syndicate. Mm. Rather than all this celebrated going to the National Assembly and then begging for... for, for, for it's a whole lot of nonsense. If you, can, if you can arrest a pickpocket at 18, 19 I, 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 and take them to court and get them jailed for six months, one year, hmm. if she's involved in this, the, the, what you're going to have here, if you go deeper, you're going to look at the area of forgery. Okay? She's most likely belongs to a syndicate and you'll be looking at forgery. And then the National Assembly sits down, national, not even state or local government, the National Assembly. Register of Jam was of Jam. Everybody was there, wasting time. I, I don't know. We need to get our priorities right. Wasting time. It's simple. She compromised the results. Hand over to the to the police to the CID. Let them do further investigations to find out if indeed she belongs to a syndicate. And then let justice be done. If there's going to be any pardoning at all, then it should be at the court level. Remember, she's not a small girl. She's 19. Hmm. She's an adult. <laughs> Let's go take a what look do at you the... Think? So I, I completely agree with you that the moment she owned up, <laughs> the national, the House of Reps should have just hands off and... Hands and, off and, know, and gone find something. You know, something. I, I totally agree so with you. So is, is, is this what they want? Is this what they want to be doing to start riding our luxury jeeps at our own cost. <laughs> is it, is it <laughs> it's, it's really, to me, I, I, I agree totally with you that, I mean, they shouldn't have. Yes, they wanted to get in initially by saying that it should be investigated, but the moment she owned up to it, uh, they should have just allowed, you know. It should never have gotten to the National Assembly in the first instance. You have bodies that can take care of these things. At... at even the jam registrar, knowing that she's 19, instead of making, going to press conferences and so on and so forth, should immediately have alerted the police CID. I mean, what, what, is, what, what is it? Because it's obvious she didn't do it alone. It's very obvious to me that this is something syndicated. We, we need to think deep and stop wasting valuable time. Why are we even talking about it, sir? It's in the papers. <laughs> it's in the papers. Okay. I mean, they, they should bring to conclusion this story. It should normally. I uh, don't think I'll talk about it again. Mm. Police are in prison water for aiding inmates to escape. That usually happens. Four foreigners jailed for... No, no. Lagos Council probes retirees extortion. Task force denies involvement. Two injured in Lagos, Ibadan Road crash. Amotekum arrests 80 year old Ekiti man. Others for vandalism. Another one, Sheriff. Mm. Another one. Delta Gateman backs life jail for defiling it. There is something going on. I can't place my finger on it. Court remand sales girl for stealing employers 2.3 million. Mm -hmm. How did she lay her hands on this kind of money? She's a sales girl. A food vendor. Mm -hmm. Where would it? Okay. They said she stole 2.3 from her employer. Let me see if they said, if there's anything about how. Okay, <laughs> she stole a bank automated teller machine card mm. from the complainant. Mm. That that ends it. Mm. But the person would just be seeing the alert before I run to the bank is gone. Gone. Gunmen robbed us near Benway Police Checkpoint and so on and so forth. There's not much news today. There's not much news today. Last batch of Lagos Heart Pilgrims returned today. They are welcome back. So there's not much news to talk about today. Yep. So let's. Um, we're almost out of time. Let's speak our last story, and that's from Daily Trust. 
It's on the sports page of Daily Trust. Toby Amushan disputes doping charge, vows to clear her name. Yes, um, I, I think that Toby's handlers need to be sensitive to the fact that there's politics in sports. Mm. Uh, and therefore, you must follow the rules to the letter. So apparently, she she is what you call and um, something to do with being absent when she should be made available, uh, when she should be she should be available for 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 dope testing. That is the main point, you know, not not so much that substance was found, but she was not available at a time she should have done the proper test. When you're an athlete, you must watch what you eat. You must, especially when you are black. Let's call it this. Any 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 boxer, for example, will tell you that if you are black and your opponent is white, the best thing to do is just to knock him out. Mm. Uh, there's politics in sports. We all know that. After we won the Olympics, mm. then the sudden death, whatever, was yeah, quickly was, removed. Was ah. removed. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So you must you must must be conscious of that. And that, uh, darling, Toby Amoson. I, I hope um, it says that Toby Amoson has today been charged and provisionally suspended for three whereabout failures. Mm. Three times he hasn't turned up, and um, yes, mm. we're going to pause here for now. We'll be back tomorrow um, at six um, fifteen, the first part, and then at seven thirty, the second part. Thank you, sir, for coming. Thank you. Mm. Let's take this break. When we return, July is Fibroid Awareness Month. Hmm. And then we'll talk about fibroids. So if you're a guy, a lady, this is a conversation for everybody. Stay here. It's midnight. You're on an important call. Suddenly you hear... You have one minute remaining. You quickly check your wallet. <laughs> and there's no cash. <laughs> What if you could recharge without cash and even get some bonus? No on credit? No problem. Recharge your MTN line by downloading my MTN NG app or dial star 904 hash to buy airtime directly from your bank account anytime, any day and enjoy a 15% bonus on every recharge. Yes, it's that easy. MTN, what are we doing today? Shade, why mini? Why you see red for this heavy sun? No be that kind reno. This one now data rain with my MTN NG app. Oh. Now one gig data for everybody will download the app. You know no, me now. No, you can also get up to two gig free data when you recharge from 500 naira and above with your debit card or my MTN NG app. Eh? Up to two gig data when I recharge with my debit card for my MTN NG app. This now real data reno. No be there end oh. You can also get 10% extra on top every airtime recharge when you recharge for my MTN NG app. Wait, Feso, you mean say if I recharge for money on my MTN NG app? You get 10% extra airtime. For evening, Uko. Ten Did you know daily tea drinking is suitable for everyone as part of a healthy, balanced diet and lifestyle? So... And I want to assume that you would run because I want to give the listeners context for the conversation. In 2019, you were running late to um, Atiku Abubakar. What did you learn then that you will not repeat this time? Yes, when is the president coming out to address us? There's a few things. One, I have a burden and a passion for young people. The fact that you have elected a man does not mean then you begin to order him around. The president will do whatever is good for the country at any given time. Mr. Adeshino, is the president responsible to the people what should the next president do to root out stakeholders who are complicit you fire those those that need to be fired are fired it's looking like the brand new chelsea attacking with so much fluidity and what can you say about that martin i know you follow chelsea quite closely i live close to the chelsea training ground that's what you mean by that i'm not <laughs> a